The Batman is pushed back. CNN's Brooke Baldwin gives an emotional update on her COVID-19 battle. John Krasinski hosts a virtual prom, and the first trailer for Ryan Murphy's new Netflix show is here. First, the release of The Batman starring Robert Pattinson has been delayed due to the ongoing impact of the coronavirus pandemic. This news comes after production was shut down in March. The film from director Matt Reeves, who previously shared these first look photos and a camera test on social media, had been set to hit the big screen on June 25th, 2021. It will now ride into theaters on October 1st, 2021. The change was among a number of Warner Brothers release date shifts announced on Monday. Next, CNN anchor Brooke Baldwin is opening up about her experience with COVID-19 and her symptoms. Baldwin, who revealed her diagnosis back on April 3rd, wrote in an essay published by CNN, it took a full two-week beating on my body. I went to some very dark places, especially at night. The anchor said that she experienced body aches, a loss of taste and smell, fevers and chills that would die down but then return, quote, with a vengeance. She also said that she would oftentimes sleep 10 to 12 hours a night and then wake up soaking in sweat. She also wrote in the emotional essay, I never knew when it would end. It was relentless, scary, and lonely. She says she is now feeling better. John Krasinski is back with some more good news. This Sunday's episode of the actor and director's YouTube series spotlighting positive news stories featured footage from a virtual prom hosted by Krasinski, complete with performances by the Jonas Brothers. And Billie Eilish. I'm the bad type, make your mama sad type, make your girlfriend mad type. Finally, the first trailer for Ryan Murphy's new limited series, Hollywood, is here. In addition to following Tinseltown hopefuls, the show rewrites history and spotlights the unfair systems and biases across race, gender, and sexuality that continue to this day. I'm scared, but what I'm not is surprised. I will not live in fear. For more on all these stories, head to th.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.